Let's work problem 77 from University of Physics by OpenStax. This is in chapter 7. So a man of mass 80 kg runs up a flight of stairs uh, 20 meters high in uh, 10 seconds. How much power is used to lift the man? And if the man is, his body is 25% efficient, how much power does he expend? Okay, so we know the mass is equal to 80 kilograms. Now the flight of stairs is 20 meters high. So we know this distance to be 20 meters. And we do not know this distance, but that actually does not matter because the only force that the man is having to work against, as far as we can tell from the problem, is his weight. This is his weight, which is equal to his mass times gravity. And so the only displacement that matters is the one that is parallel to that direction. And the only displacement that is parallel to that direction is the y component, the vertical displacement. So when calculating work, the horizontal displacement is not going to matter if we're only considering gravity. So then our equation work equals f dot ds simplifies to F, the force of gravity, times the displacement, D, uh, which in this case is going to be MGH. You recognize that that is the same as his change in uh, potential energy. And so the work done, which is also equal to the energy, uh, output would be 80 times 9.81 times the height, which is 20 meters. And putting that in the calculator, let's see. Now the 15,696 joules. Now that is the energy use. What is the power? Well, the power is the change in energy or the energy output over the time. We know that this energy was expanded in 10 seconds. So then the power is going to be equal to 15696 joules divided by 10 seconds, which will give me 15 watts. So the power we can say is 1.6 kilowatts. Now, if his body is 25% efficient, that means that this only makes up 25% of the power that his um, his body required. So then the total power would be the power that he used, 1.6 times 4, which would be 1.6 kilowatts times 4 so his total power output would be 6.3 kilowatts 